fellow YouTube YouTubers, watchers, thanks for coming again and uh, joining me on the <sighs> device review. Sorry, I brain farted. Been a long night. Um, what we're going to talk about today is not the atomizer, but this. Uh, what was what I thought was was red. Uh, it's actually pink in person, pinkish, I guess. It is red, but not the red that I like. Um, ABS uh, plastic uh, box mug. Um, it is uh, an un. It's not a true mechanical, although I believe, yeah, I got from Angel Sigs. Yeah, I know they sell a lot of clones. That's okay by me. Um, this one, I, I don't think it's a clone. I, I don't, I, I think it's just a regular box mod. Um, it is unregulated. It's not mechanical. There's wires and there's a MOSFET. I want to say it's a MOSFET. It looks like a MOSFET chip. Um, let me take a quick bait. Oh man, I forgot what I had in there. Man, I have some Mod Squad. Um, it seems to be my, my new local, uh, my favorite local vape shop. It's a, um, the, um, Uncle Jesse's on crack. Man, is it good. Um, I'm running this at a .13. I'm trying some new, new wires out, some new, uh, builds. It's an ugly .13, uh, dual. Nope, it's a dual, dual coil, um, it's 22 gauge wrapped in 20, 26 gauge wire around a 2.4 millimeter bit, comes out to about, uh, I think it's three wraps, four wraps, comes out to about 0.13, decent vapor production, uh, the box does very well with it, um, it is a parallel looking juice everywhere. Parallel box. It's got a nice semi clicky, semi squishy button. It's a nice big uh, chrome style button there. Push it, vapor happens. What I do want to do is uh, take it down on the table with it. Um, Let you see it, and then uh, we'll come back up top and vape on it. Yeah, quick uh, on the table. Two magnets there, two magnets on the door, a V. Don't know what that means. Anyone knows, help me out. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, two brass uh, or copper uh, little negative feet. Right there's the negative symbols. Right there up top's the positives. Uh, only issues I've really had is that little nut right there actually would spin on me uh, when you over tighten your 510 up top and by the way that pin is not 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 spring loaded um, sorry about that um, and that MOSFET ish chip uh, actually came loose the glue came loose uh, see look there I am pushing, it does not move. Um, it did come loose when I tried to super sub ohm. Other than that, the wiring's pretty nice and tidy. There, it's now focused. Um, and like I said, it's a squishy, yet, I guess there's no click. Squishy little button. Not a bad little mod. It uh, feels good. All right, let's get up top and talk about it. All right, it. thanks for that super super short quick uppy closey I, I tried like three four different times my phone uh, doesn't have enough storage apparently um so it looks like I may be purchasing an iPad before I really wanted to um, just so I can have more more storage or learn how to use Adobe photo editor um not about that it's about this little box here um it's actually not so little um here it is against the castigator uh, 
I mean, it's quite a bit taller. It's about the same thickness, maybe a little bit thicker. Uh, okay, so it's it's a lot thicker. It's a lot taller, and it's a lot what the hell, and it's a lot wider. Um, but it doesn't feel oversized in the hand, in my hand, and I don't have the biggest mitts. Good vape production. Um, I'd say don't build below a 0 0.2 on this guy. Um, that'll keep your MOSFET nice and cool. Oh, that's something I did forget. Right here, there's a little hole. You can see it. Um, and I believe, I believe, 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 that is for the MOSFET chip. Now, I'm saying it's a MOSFET. But I'm not 100%. I believe it is. That's what it looks like. So it's a MOSFET-ish chip. That's all I got for you. It's a nice box. Um, it's cheap. It's under 20 bucks. It's 19 and change. I mean, if you're looking to get into a dual, unregulated, parallel box mod, that's a, that, that's a pretty specific uh, niche, I guess. If you're looking to, to get into a regulated or, you know, just any box mod, unregulated rather, any box mod, and you don't want to spend a lot, um, I suggest this one. And because they're ran in parallel, you can run it with one battery um, if you so choose to. One battery, it's still firing. You just can't build as low. Um, I always practice battery safety. If you haven't, Please click subscribe if you have. Thank you very much. Uh, I don't know. I should say join CASA. That's a good advocacy. Thanks for watching.